In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at how to profit from Bluebit's Australian Open multi bonus promo. So we'll be using the lay at the start matcher today and the promo is place an Australian open match result multi of three legs or more. And if your multi fails by one leg, get your stake back as a bonus bet up to $50. And you can see here, they've got a few different promos. They've got NBA ones and I think there's EPL ones as well. So the process will be the same, but obviously just a different sport. So if we jump over to bonus bank and we come up to calculators, and then we're going to select multis, multi matches, and lay at start. We'll be focusing on today. And down here we've got our table of information. So first we've got the bookie. So we we'll select blue bet. Underneath we have the sport. So we we'll select tennis. And then we have the competition. It's pretty much just Australian Open going on, but we'll select that one anyway. And it's a three leg multi. We're focusing on the match odds. And here you can see the min and max odds. So if we actually jump back over to the promo hit the terms and conditions here each leg needs to be a minimum of minimum odds of 1.2 and the total odds of the multi needs to equal at least three or more so if we head back over to the multi we can change this min odds here to 1.2 we can change the max odds as well focusing on slightly shorter odds usually results in better value but we'll see and we might have to fiddle about with that in a minute then over here we've got the back stake so the back stake was 50 the bonus bet was 50 dollars as well and 80% retention at somewhere like Bluebet is fairly reasonable, so we can keep that the same. And now if we head down, these are the matches that Bluebet has selected for now. So you've got Taylor Fritz, Rublev and Kasper Ruud. But you can see here the total back and lay odds is actually 2.4, so we need to get that above 3. And how you can do that, if you scroll even further down, you can actually uncheck some of these matches and put a different match in its place. I think we're going to struggle to get the odds over three here, even if we do replace some of them. So what you can do is come back up to the max odds and we will just increase that slightly. Maybe we'll go to 1.8. And it's increased it to 2.83 here. So it's put Greeks pour in now at 1.6, but we still need to get the odds up slightly. So what we can do is maybe we will take the fritz match out and we can add let's see if this one will work so cam nori versus casper rude so that's 2.98 so still not quite enough so really the only one we can probably add here is humbert versus Herkak. so we'll add this one down here and now you can see the odds are at 3.46 and each leg is over 1.2 as well and if we come back up to the top so we have an expected value of seven dollars 41 again you can probably mess about with these a little bit and actually get a slightly higher expected value but for now on the sake of the video i'm just going to go with this as the value is still on our side anyway but it probably is a good option just to have a little play around there and see if you can get a little bit more value and underneath the expected value you can see our worst case scenario would be minus 29 dollars and 71 cents and our best case scenario would be $89.28. So our best case scenario would be all three losing, which is unlikely, but you've got a few slightly bigger odds ones in there, so you never know, and it would be a nice little tidy profit. And then you've got a whole different range here, so you've got if a couple of them lose, you profit $9.29, and they're all in kind of different orders as well, so you can just check which ones win and lose down here. So the first win will represent this first match and so on. So the next thing to do would be to head back over to Bluebet and we'll add these to our bet slip. So we'll jump over to Bluebet and we'll select the Australian Open and we're just going to look for these matches now. So I believe we had Talon Greekspoor, if I'm not mistaken, Herkax and who was the other one? And Rublev as well. Now if we scroll down here you can see the odds of the multi are 3.46. We can just double check that all these odds match up as well. So you've got Rublev at 1.37, which is correct. Uh, we've got Herkax at 1.48, 58, sorry, and that is correct. And then what was the last one? Greek Sport at 1.6, and that's correct as well. So the next thing we can do is open up these markets at Betfair as well. So I'm going to do that now. So the easiest way to find a market will either be to come down to tennis down the side here on sports and look for it that way. You can see there's quite a few games being played at the moment, so I might just type them in in the search bar. And then what I'm going to do is just open a couple of different tabs on Betfair as well, and I'll add the other ones 
quickly. So we've got our three matches added up here. The next thing to do will be just to double check that the odds are the same. So you've got Greek Spore there at 1.67, which is correct. And then we've got the Rublev is at 1.43, which is the same. And then we've got Herkax at 1.71, which is correct as well. And if any of these odds do change, you can just come back into the matcher here and then you just type in whatever the new odds are and it will change the information up here as well. So the next thing to do would be just to place our bet at blue bet and we can see here there's plenty of liquidity in these markets so you've got 51 dollars there 245 dollars and about 1400 dollars there so we should be okay getting matched so we'll come over to blue bet we'll place our multi at 50 dollars hit place bet just make sure everything gets confirmed and you can see it's confirmed there so we're all good and now if we jump back over to lay at the start matcher we can start placing our lays so we're going to lay $49.38 on Talon Greek Spore 49.38 I believe it was yep and then we can just hit place bet that's been confirmed then it will be $49.64 on Rublev hit place bet again Make sure that's confirmed so we're all good there and then we have $49.59 on Hercax and then hit confirm and we're all set to go but again the process will be the same with any other kind of similar multi offers and as long as we're taking good value up here and in the long run we'll definitely be making some good profits hopefully in this case all three will lose but I'm sure if they don't hopefully we'll hit one of these other nice little tidy profits here so hopefully that's given you a good idea on how to use delay at the start matcher Hopefully you can start making some nice profits from it. Thank you for watching and we'll catch you guys in the next one.